In today's project, we manually draw magnetic lines of flux. We pick a starting point and check the field's direction using a compass. In whatever direction it points, we mark a new point about an inch away. Then we draw a line connecting the two points. We repeat this process over and over, starting each step with the compass at the latest point. With this simple compass and a sharpie, we can draw complex magnetic lines of flux around a powerful magnet. These lines indicate the direction of the magnetic field, and you can see why. To set this up, we rolled out some giant sheets of paper on a wood table and set a powerful two by two by one inch thick block magnet in the center. This made a large, pretty interesting magnetic field across much of the table's four foot by eight foot span. Some of the field lines loop around, traveling from one pole of the magnet to the other. Other lines leave the page entirely. Where are they going? To the Earth's north and south poles. You can still follow them, but it's a long walk. To illustrate this process with the largest magnet we know of, the Earth, we drew a few flux lines in a parking lot using a similar method. Look at the compass, take a step in that direction. Look at the compass, take another step in that direction. It's not very interesting though, since, no surprise, all the lines point north. 